joined by former LSU point guard Tamika Johnson, former WNBA Rookie of the Year and WNBA Champion. A special day here in LSU athletics and LSU basketball. The grand opening of the LSU basketball practice facility. What does this moment mean to you being a former player? It's surreal. Uh, there's so many people that paved the way for this to happen. Uh, not, not just me, there's so many people before me that fought for women's basketball. And to have a facility like this where the young women can come in and play anytime they want, it's open 24 hours for the former players to come back and participate in any time we want. It's unbelievable. I'm excited that I get to see it. From you as a player perspective, what advantages does this give a team? Um, when I was here, we had to share the facilities with volleyball, we had to share with uh, men's basketball, and if there was, was an event happening and the feedback, we had to share it. This, this allows you to come in on your own time, uh, practice when you need to practice, change times when you need to change time, and it gives the, the team enough, uh, it gives them something different. Like They can come in whenever they want. They don't have to just go in and, and practice with everybody. There's enough courts on the side where you can have your own goal. You can participate whenever you want. I, I think it's great. And you just wrapped up another season with the Phoenix Mercury back home here in Baton Rouge. You're also an author now. You just wrote a children's book. Talk about that process and what that was like. Um, it's great. I am an author now. Uh, it started on the 1st of August of this year. Um, it's great. I love doing things for kids. The book is about uh, decisions, decisions, decisions. That's the name of it. And it's just now kids have to make decisions a lot earlier than we have to. Uh, and it's based on me, but uh, it's about my life to pick some things and decisions that I had to make as an early child. The hardest part was trying to capture the audience, but I think we did a good job of that. Grand opening of the LSU basketball practice facility was tonight. KG, Tia, thanks for joining us. What is this moment meant for y'all? Uh, it's a great moment just to see how much effort and you know time and money that the school is investing in both the men's and women's basketball program. And just to reward the former players for all the hard work that they've done. And it's kind of like a monument a tribute to them. All right, Tia, how about your thoughts? It's been a great experience. Um, just to see everybody come together to put this facility together for us. Um, we're just so happy that we have it now, that we can just come in and work on our game and just to get our team better. Now, you've been in it for a few weeks, uh, even longer in the summer, but the final pieces have been put together. What's your favorite part of the facility? Um, probably the Walk of Fame, the Hall of Fame. I don't know what it's called, but probably that, just the details and uh, just to see all the different former players and awards both men's and women's side. How about you two? My favorite part is the gym because we can just come in and shoot on our own now anytime we want. Right, when you look down below, what's it like to now finally have room to go this way, play that way, and go full court, and uh, having all that room as compared to what the Aux gym offered? It's, it's great. I mean, just it's a state-of-the-art facility there. You can't ask for anything better than, than what we have. You know, people aren't bumping into each other, so the balls aren't hitting, you know, flying all over the gym. It's, it's great because the space adds so much more, like, ability to do what you want to do. That's good.